Canada had informed India well in advance about the updated travel advisory, which was based on certain videos targeting Canadians on the net. All eyes are forward. External Affair Minister S.J. Schenker's address to UN General Assembly in New York tomorrow, where he is expected to respond to Canadian Prime Minister Justin Trudeau's al credible allegation over Indian involvement in the killing of Park trained Khalistani terrorist Hardeep Najjar in June. While New Delhi is still waiting for Canada to provide legal evidence of linking India to Khalistan Tiger Force. Chief Niger's killing. It is quite evident that Trudeau's sick politics will not allow him to back down on the issue. Whether the quality of evidence or intelligence will still stand the legal test or not. Expect Trudeau's to throw some Indian name in the air and pin the Niger murder on him or her. The fact is that the sick vote is so important to Canadian politics that former Prime Minister Stephen Harper requested Prime Minister Narendra Modi to visit a Suri Gurudwara in British Columbia when he visited Canada in 2015. And it is another matter that PM Modi found his supporters, even within the radicalized committee, some two hours away from Vancouver. Meanwhile, Canada updated its travel advisory to India after duly informing South Bloc well in advance about the impending exercise as some videos targeting Canada were floating on the net. It is understood that New Delhi was informed as at a senior level that the travel advisory was being updated and nothing much should be read into it.